opportunity for every single young person in San Antonio because a young at heart will also benefit from it as a result. Thank you all very much. Uh, be proud of yourselves, San Antonio. Long road to go, but we've done some great things so far. Destiny. Hi, my name is Reagan. As many of you know, teen pregnancy has far-reaching effects on our community. Teen mothers are more likely to drop out of school, be poor, and be a single parent. Teen fathers are more likely to get less education, earn less in their lifetime, and be less involved with their child's life. And the child is more likely to die within the first year, score lower on math and reading, and become a teen parent themselves. As you can see, San Antonio is making progress. This number of teen births has dropped by over 1,000 since the year 2000. More recently, the number of teen births has dropped by 543 since 2010. Hi, my name is Jane Emma. Despite our progress, we still have many challenges now and in our future. Even with the low number of teen births, this will still account for 125 kindergarten classes that will be filled with children of teen parents in the year 2017. The 2012 cost of teen childbearing was estimated at $59.6 million. With the decrease in teen births, Bear County residents have saved approximately $10.3 million since 2010. Hi, my name is Lexi. Our teen birth rate for females ages 15 to 19 has declined by 38% since 2000. More recently, our teen birth rate declined by 15% since 2010. However, we are still 46% higher than the national teen birth rate. When we look across the adolescent age groups, the majority of teen births have occurred among females ages 18 to 19. However, it is important to note that prevention programs starting at an early age are necessary to build key skills to change behavior. Hi, I'm Jonas. <clears throat> in 2012, teen births occurred across Bear County. Three zip codes had teen birth rates three to four times the national teen birth rate, but none were four times the national teen birth rate. When we look at repeat teen births, 610 teen mothers who gave birth already to one previous child. This accounted for 22% of all births in 2012. And this was only 1% de uh, decrease from 2011. To ensure that the progress continues, Project Birth Program formed the San Antonio Teen Pregnancy Prevention Collaborative in 2012. Over the last several months, community partners has work, have worked diligently to complete a community logic model on teen pregnancy prevention. This is a great accomplishment and we thank them all for their hard work. We would also like to recognize other efforts within our community. One leading example would be Alpha Academy, a small charter school. The first charter school in San Antonio to implement a high school evidence-based teen pregnancy prevention program. We hope others will join in our efforts as well. If you would like more information regarding the 2012 Teen Pregnancy Report, please visit our website at sanantonio.gov forward slash Project Worth. This concludes our press conference for today. Thank you for coming.